Hi guys, I am Cody, and um, I uh, I originally messed up the the this video. Um, I the intro of this video, so I am the editor, and uh, I'm just doing the intro. Um, you might see me later on um, because my original recording was really bad and messed up. It was supposed to be better, but um, hope you enjoy the video. I've been thinking about my channel, um, and basically I've always wanted to do a, um, actually you create a, uh, channel just for art, but of course I, this is exactly how I feel about, um, putting my stuff on YouTube. So. I have webtoons and webtoons is a place where if you don't know about it just uh, click the link in the description below I will have that all set up so basically my channel I, I don't like uploading art and stuff to YouTube because uh, YouTube I feel like I feel like is like better for gaming but um, Hey guys, it's me again, editor. Uh, I just wanted to elaborate a little bit. Um, so when I think of YouTube, I think of like uh, gaming, um, uh, animation would be the closest relationship to art. So if um, which animation is video, and you could post your videos on YouTube. So if that's the case, then you got me there. But usually, just gaming, art, vlogs. Um, that that type of stuff, um, not necessarily um, art. I wouldn't think of art being on YouTube, but um, I guess if you vlog yourself, then then sure, why not? If, I mean, it's all viewers. Um, if if you're passionate about it, then why why not go through with it? Um, continue with the the video. But that that's what I usually use it for. Um, but sometimes I do. Uh, just browse around and um, find other, try and, you know, broaden my um, my perspective and, um, or not my perspective, my, um, the, the YouTubers that I'm interested in. So, uh, basically this video is going to be um, mainly about my art stuff. So, so here I actually uh, forgot the word review. <laughs> Literally, I, I couldn't think of it at the time. Um, so I have um, a brief overview before we get um, too deep. Um, Huey, Huey on Inspiray Inc. I used to, I used to thought it was uh, Ink Spray, but it's Inspiray. Um, it's just a name, <laughs> but. Anyways, I meant to say, um, I've I've um had the Huey on in Inspiroy Inc. Um, so yeah, for a little bit now. Um, it hasn't been too long. I recently got it, uh, but uh, I this is when I first dove into it, and not first, but um, I've done a little doodle with it just to test out and to uh get all the keys down. Um, really, and um uh, now this. So, yeah. So I have the Huey on uh, Inspiroy Ink. Uh, it's really cool. I just got it. Um, mainly, not really for the purpose of this video, but I was hoping to get it done uh, for the main reason of this video, and that is because um, the YouTuber Jazza. Which Guys, I'm back. I'm in this a lot, but the main reason of this video is um, is basically. I, I'm explaining myself a little bit, um, especially since this is the first few videos in my um, drawing uh, channel, my drawing channel. Um, I have other channels. Um, one is a mix. Um, it's all in the featured channels uh, if this gets uploaded right and if this is on, uh, uh, if this does uh, win or whatever. Uh, you guys should uh, come to my channel then and then pop into the feature channel everything's all set up for you guys um, just keep an eye out for me I guess um, I'm all over but anyways uh, Jazza like I mentioned before um, 
if you don't know who he is, what he does, he is a art YouTuber, um, all about art creativity, and all that jizz, um, he does do some animations, which that is one thing if, uh, that I talked about before, or previously in this video, I guess, um, is something that I would expect being on YouTube, which is, that, that's, that's it. <laughs> that's like my main reason um so because he does that i mean like jazz is passionate about um art and stuff i i love art i draw uh digitally and whatnot um uh i mean i also like gaming i like art i like games um i also when i'm gaming i see the point in recording um because like what's the point of just playing it when you could just um play it with other people and, and enjoy the experience i guess that's how he feels about art so when he's drawing um th <laughs> this is all about me i don't know about him personally because i have never met him but um <laughs> yeah just check out his uh stuff either in description below um his channel or just type it up on youtube doesn't matter if you're always no actually he changed it to jazza um just jazza uh i'm sorry about that <laughs> he changed it to you you can see all about that um but my mistake uh jazza search that up in youtube and he should come up basically i'm gonna the next few segments are gonna be about my uh about some time lapse uh hopefully and just get really creative with some of this stuff um just show you some of my art and whatnot so um so yeah this is a Huey on Inspiroy ink has two sides to it and what was I doing again also if you go on the Huey on uh, website link in description below uh, you can see up more of the specs from there um yeah Huey on tablet Link in description below. Jeez, I got a lot of links to do. So, link in description below. Thank you, um, previous me, for not going on a tangent. Of course, uh, the Huion Inspiroy ink is really cool. Heck yeah, it is. Uh, I have to buy the gloves separately, but that that was all fine. It arrived pretty nice. It came comes with a case, whatnot. You could also draw on your phone. I just recently well i mean i got a computer so i decided that i w was gonna draw more on my computer so i'm just so this is a little bit of a disclaimer uh my uh tablet i didn't get for the or my computer i didn't get for the t uh video um or the um uh, uh art competition or anything um uh but my my drawing tablet i i've wanted a drawing tablet since um since i really knew digitally uh, digital drawing is a thing um i wanted a, a computer so i could game so i wanted a computer a lot longer uh than drawing uh for me but drawing is uh, a totally separate thing but i since i knew it was a thing um I, uh, before then I used to do pen and paper, but, um, drawing digitally is, uh, now, now that I'm able to draw digitally and know how it works and whatever, um, I am so pumped for it and, um, <laughs> ready to, ready to do more and, uh, do art and creativity and, as Jazza would say, art and creativity, um, but, yeah. For actually, we can take a look at this now. I want to show you guys something, and this probably might b blow your mind. Um, let's uh, go here. Um, so basically, if we go on web to nope, um, if we go on web. I want to show you something entirely crazy. This is, um, so, oh, <laughs> sneak peek, 
um, spoilers, <laughs> um, but anyways, um, yeah, so, if we go way back when, I'm actually gonna go to episode 1 and show you a little bit of this, because this is in crazy, this is crazy, so, oh gosh, three phones ago, <laughs> here, c come closer, um, Three phones ago. <laughs> Three phones ago, yeah. <laughs> uh, I started this episode. Uh, started the this this um, whatever you call it, Blade of Econ. This story. <laughs> this whatever you call it. <laughs> this story. <laughs> I call my my story a what what do you call it? Um, and this was all done with three phones ago. <laughs> ah, three phones ago. Alright, in all seriousness, um, all fun and games, um, I also noticed that, um, during editing, my head is kind of, uh, chopped off, and sometimes, uh, that does happen, um, when, when I'm recording, cause, like, uh, my setup is not really the greatest right now, but, um, yeah, my head sometimes be down here, and, yeah. Sometimes I gotta, uh, kind of fix that in my, like, like, posture, I guess, um, or, like, sometimes I gotta fix camera and readjust it and whatnot, but, um, yeah, I also noticed that in my webcam, um, just bear with me. Also, there's, uh, some audio clicking, I, I, I don't know what it is, um, but, uh, please just bear with me for a little bit. I, I don't know what's wrong with it, um. I'm probably gonna fix it for the future, um, so, yeah. I recently found an app called Medibang Paint, um, I've looked around for quite a while and I couldn't find a decent drawing app that I like, and then when I did, I started to get into, uh, uh, drawing digitally, um, and before that I've, uh, drawn on pen and paper, and then I've been, like, so immense into drawing really that I haven't really drawn on paper really since until just recently where now I'm starting to even uh buy Copic markers. I'm that's this is my next step. I'm gonna buy Copic markers and get back into physical drawing. I have digital drawing, now I'm getting back into man, I'm starting to feel like Jazza <laughs> Um how he has like all of his tablets and whatnot. Um, hopefully we could get there, guys. Um, I'm I'm also not going to say the name of this channel because this is going for Jazz's video art contest. And I'm also hoping to do this in one take because the less editing I do is noisier on me. Thank you. Um, but anyways, so all this was, oh, I remember drawing that hand. Oh, jeez, I need to redo this. So three phones ago. So here's here's my idea for this comic. Um, this comic is mainly gonna be my full embodiment of art, and of course I have other art stuff to do as well. So this is my main focus. Um, so what's gonna happen is in the main focus is that I'm gonna just draw, just draw the entire series out, have everything. And I, and yeah, have all that set. And in the meantime, I'm able to, I would like to know what they think along the way and whatnot. And then when it finally ends, uh, and everybody's like, oh my gosh, that was, a, that was the most best story ever. Round of applause, bravo, and whatnot. Okay, to be honest, I think I lost it here. Uh, I'm gonna go back, uh, create a new um a new comic and it's going to be revamped along the same line so it's going to be the same comic but all the art is redone and more consistent more professional and it's going to be there forever and once that's done I'm going to probably go t back to really want to get back into my other comic Nin Exploration reason why I haven't uploaded that is because I wanted Blade of Acorn to be this main focus and um, s 
some small branches of like other stuff that I'm able to do especially if I'm like you know not really in the mood to do a certain segment that I need to get done or whatever whatever that may be um and so that's literally all I had to say and uh your prize for sticking with me for this long is a beautiful time lapse and um other stuff um I guess I guess now we could do the time lapse so um without any further ado um I'm going to show you about my um I actually time lapsed uh this because I felt like uh, I need to get back into just sit down, do an actual real drawing on pen and paper, classic pen and paper, and actually, hold on, yeah, I did that, but what what led into that me wanting to go back into drawing is I had a friendly competition, <laughs> really, um, even though it was clear that I won. Um, so, I didn't time lapse this, but this is going to be the image as soon as it pops up, and I will be talking in the meantime, because I got a lot to talk about. Um, so, basically, it was a competition, and basically, whoever could, like, draw the best, really, and there's no prize or anything, it was just simply to who, who to draw the best, and I was like, well, it's definitely me and because it was against one other person who was I don't know all of his art seemed like they were the Incredible Hulk or Aladdin um, Will Smith <laughs> um, however I I do see myself as drawing close to anime and this is what I've drawn uh, for the competition uh, it's kind of anime-ish, but the dog is really the one that definitely sticks out. So basically, what I was originally f referring to, the, this dog right here, what I was originally planning for that dog is uh, for him to be like he's popping out the shirt or something. But uh, it's, it's just like, I don't know, I, I, I was kind of hung up on what to draw. And it was just like that. <laughs> but <laughs> anyway, that don't matter. Um, I definitely thought I beat him. So now the story to this one is then I decided to create a new art to time lapse it. Um, and we're going to see that here. Um, create a new art and to time lapse it. Definitely to show that I was better than him. Uh, so, I drew a circle. I then uh, draw a facial feature. I actually, you actually can't see it. So, if you see here, I draw a, cir a circle. It's kind of covered by my hand. But then I quickly went down, and then went like this. It's really light. I, I, you can't, you can't, you can't really see it. But <laughs> I, I did do that. There, you can see it better now where I did it um, and yeah and then I just drew some facial features but so the thing is about this drawing as it's playing um, I love that eye by the way the eye was superb everything was just like so good but I felt like it was out of proportion it was like so ugh, ugh. but I, I guess I was fine with it um, enough to the point that I was like this 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 is this has to be fine enough um <laughs> but um i also um as i drew it here I had struggles with the arm um as i started finishing the piece or or made progress with the piece yeah i was just like struggling with the arm i was like you know what the best position is straight down just straight down maybe even a little bent um but um, again, I wasn't really that fond of the proportions of the body or whatever, but it was it was good, I guess enough. Um, so I, now now I'm going over in pen because uh, 
that that's kind of what you do after you sketch you go over and pen and then you eventually build on the on the outlines and then uh thicken up other layers get um do do maybe like fine point pen or, or not fine point pen or like whatever ink um so it's like pen and eraser and then ink and then thicker pen and whatnot but um yeah that and and then color of course um i'm gonna probably eventually color them as uh whenever i get copic markers which will probably be soon um because i've been getting so much stuff over the last um thing so the story behind this one is that when, when i was doing the art competition he was like this definitely beats you um and i was like no it didn't it originally looked like the hulk Will Smith and a Minecraft villager. Smash all that into one and you have his art. And then he was like, you know what, I could care less about this competition. I, w I here have this, take it. I could care less what you do with it. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to actually make it something as if I would draw it. Uh, but it. I, I basically just rearranged the face that was it and I felt too lazy so I was like I'm, I'm just gonna ink over it and yeah that, that's basically this <laughs> so um I, I pretty much just did the face that's pretty much all I messed around with um, other than inking it um, or using a pen um, but I did rearrange some other stuff too, but not not a whole lot. I basically just decided to make it my own. So yeah. Genie Will Smith plus Minecraft Villager plus Incredible Hulk. Uh we're also th uh thinking about uh collaborating and making a comic um of course that'll be a whole separate thing i'm not going to divert um that'll be like a sp uh small thing but it will it will be definitely it will be like a side job if if uh my web t if my, if my art is a career then my blade of egg con is my main focus then uh my second focus currently is um uh facial drawings i want to say so basically that will be um like i don't know how to explain it so i'm just going to pull up an example hopefully it's um when this shows up it's, it's like this stuff like you uh you have an image and then you pretty much digitalize them um digitalize person i guess like um, of course, if you want to do this, of course, go on my uh, Instagram, link in the description below, and um, uh, follow me, DM me a photo of you in the pose you want. So, like, um, this one, this one's a good example. So, if you want to, you take a picture of yourself in, like, this pose, and then... You say, I want to look like a fairy. Then I'll add your wings, your your whatever, to make you look like a like a fairy. And there you go. Um. So, of course, I I uh, also am running a business on this, so don't expect too much um, of it. And if you want to go to my business and commission me. Uh, link in description below and all that jizz. Go down there. Um, uh, also, my favorite one that I've did since um, the my favorite one since uh, I've got actually the my favorite one that I've did on my Huron tablet and the first I want to say the first art that I've done with my tablet. Yeah. This, this, I, I thought this was so amazing. So, I also posted it on Instagram, so follow me there. Um, links in description. 
Uh, I also, I think this might even even be before that. My first ever drawing on my tablet um, might be before that one, but I'm not sure. Anywho, um, uh, we're gonna actually do some art right now. Really, this will be a time lapse, I guess, from here on. But. So this is the finished product after all said and done, and um, yeah, but that's that's the end of this video. Uh, please just subscribe, join the Empire, click, check out all the links down below, uh, go to the future channels, um, definitely check those out, um, because they should be all by me, but if this does happen to be on, uh, the Jazz Contest, whatever you call it, um, uh, then... Once you go to my channel, check that, um, and I thank you, um, and I guess I'll see you all in the next one, um, good luck to whoever, whoever wins and whatever, and I will see you all in the next one, bye.